let something else do the work for us. Come on, I'll walk you through what we're thinking. You remember that creature we talked about before you went to Nera? The thing that eats Terramorphs, the Asilis? Apparently, they were bloodhounds for Terramorphs. But when the UC ran low on synthetic foods during the Colony War, the Asilis were chosen to fill in the gaps. We thought they were harvested to extinction. But in the data, the research team found the location of a few remaining specimens. As you can see, what we're proposing is bringing them back. We'd breed populations of them, distribute them to human worlds, and then let nature take its course, using a method that thousands of years of adaptation have already perfected. We could speed up their breeding process using, well, using some of the same technologies that were used to create me. We even think that with some time and investigation, we could use the Asili's hunting skills to track down the Terramorph transmission method at long last. Find out how humanity spread them and put an end to the Terramorph problem definitively. If you pick a fight with one, or you're a Terramorph, sure. But Asili's were already spread across the galaxy once before during the Colony War. As livestock, they're far less of a danger than the one we're proposing to clean up. I really think it could. Now, there is another option for removing the Terramorphs from our worlds. It's faster, maybe even more efficient, but riskier. A microbe. Something we could aerosolize, let spread, and have it clean up anything with Terramorph DNA for us, which would include morphs and we expect their transmission method. It'd still take time to build, test, and distribute, but no other method could hold a candle to it when it comes to sheer efficiency. Not even the Asilis. Percival assures me that they're minimal. He'll be able to encode safeguards against mutation in the agent's genetics, so that they stick to the task of cleaning up Terramorphs. But the microscopic world has a tendency to behave in ways you can't always predict. So to say there's zero risk would be a lie. Well, so that's tricky. Both plans are going to take major investments in time and resources. We're talking years of work. And not to mention some highly specialized materials. Terramorph cell lines we can breed quickly and consistently to test on. Asili's gene samples we can use to rebuild their bloodlines. Or sharpen our microbes' tracking skills. Not the sort of things any labs just got lying around. But we think we found a lead. One place in the known galaxy where we know we should be able to find all the materials we need. All paths lead to Londinium. Exactly what I was hoping to hear. Now, the UC has a small operating base on Londinian's outskirts. We're cleared for access, but we'll need to check in with the base commander, Sarah Hatoum, when we touch down. I'm gonna help Percival and Kaiser prep, but once that's done, we'll rendezvous with you there. But you need to know, Londinian? It belongs to the Terramorphs. They'll have anti-Xeno gear for us at the base, but... I'd make sure you've got your favorite arms on hand. Oh, this goddamn planet. You romanticize a place when you're away from it for long enough, but I forgot what a dust-crusted pit Mars can be. Now you, uh, what do you need? Oh, that's you then. I was informed we might be working together. Don't much care for Vanguard. But sounds like you two really got into the thick of it back in New Atlantis. 
My sister's kids live in the city. So, um, thank you for what you did there. Yeah, they both came through okay. One science division, others an artist. Effectively useless human beings that would have had no reason to be anywhere near the fighting. Still, I would hate to see anything happen to him. Now, what was it you needed? No more reliable hardware in the galaxy. I hope that we have not ultimately made a mistake in resurrecting this place. It is good to be back in our own ship. The test world is off limits. You are advised to jump to safe harbor immediately. Let me check my logs. <laughs> All right, you can proceed. We'll let them know you're on your way down. Let's see what's on this ball. is one of the most dangerous places in the Milky Way. It's with good reason my soldiers and I do everything we can to avoid entering the city. Terramorphs are omnipresent, and the structural damage left behind when... when Major Sanon's father bombed its spaceport have turned large swathes of the metropolis into a decaying labyrinth. As such, we'll be providing you all with gear, information, and uploading municipal unlock codes to your robot. Every 
tool you could need to succeed out there. Except one. Once you're on the other side of those barriers, you will be on your own. If you get into trouble, my people will not be coming. Do we understand each other? Hmm. <laughs> we'll do our best. I'll leave you to your preparations, then. You can find your equipment in our arm. Now, once you're outside the base, it's my personal suggestion you make a beeline to the nearby Aceli's plant. It contains one of our field caches. Though, I can't guarantee you. I hope you all find what you... Robot, you're coming with me. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, Commander. Percival, you all set to hook into their comms tower? Should only take a few minutes. Let's get this done and get the hell out of here. Percival will be scanning the city for our samples from here. When he finds one, he'll transmit the coordinates to us out in the field. All right. Head over to the armory and... Give him one for me, all right? Don't go into the city much. Never for long. Too risky. you're going out there willingly. Damn. All set on your gear? You... Are you ready to do this? And... Let's get this show on the road. Kaiser, Percival, everything green on your ends? I am ready. Personal comms should be routed through Kaiser now. You copy that? Roger, loud and clear. Perhaps too loud. Oh, you're a riot robot. Kaiser, kick it off.
Your shipping yard is just beyond the processing plant. Cash with some goodies is towards the rear of the facility. Kaiser, close enough for you to dial in the location of those samples from here? Yes, they're faint. But I'm detecting multiple valid signatures. I have restored power to the containers. Jackpot! Get down there and collect as many as you can.
All right. Now hand those over to Kaiser, and let's get out of here. Samples secure. Nice work. Now, earlier scan picked up a valid Terramorph sample, but... There are steam tunnels under the city, which will allow us to access the spaceport. What do you... That... That's right. Kaiser, how did you know that? I... am not sure. Percival, you see any better option? Not from where I'm standing. Got our answer. Access unlocked. We may proceed. Kaiser, this flora, this is Lazarus' plant, isn't it? Confirmed. You know, no one even realized it was a living thing until someone got it under a microscope and saw it had cells. It can't be cultivated anywhere but Londinian. <gasps> we oh. marvel. these leeches. What's keeping you things warm? What's that? My god. Look at it. A Lazarus in bloom. You know, we might be some of the only... What's... What's happening? Leeches are terramorphs. But heat leeches infest every settlement, every corner of the settled systems. That means that every single one. Oh no. You just saw that, right? You would tell me if I was losing my mind. That heat leech became a terramorph. The pests that have snuck onto every planet are baby terramorphs. Heat leeches hide out in ships, sneak away after landing, and then, with time, they transform. We... We just found out how terramorphs move between planets. Pretty Major is right. But if what we just saw... If that's possible... The Lazarus plant... It's clearly an accelerant for the Terramorph, a heat leech transformation process. Make one into the other, in an instant. But that means, if anyone knew about this, they could trigger a Terramorph spawning. You could sneak a leech into a city, or even multiple leeches, into a place like New Atlantis. Good God. The attack on New Atlantis, does this... Could someone have set that up? But first, you'd have to know the truth about all this. Well, we're never gonna know if you don't catch that thing, get after it! We may proceed. 
proceed. Go! I can't believe what we just witnessed. data from the new Atlantis and Tau Ceti attacks, right? Uploading them myself. Captain, let Kaiser take a look at that sample. Beginning analysis. It is a match. This suggests with high certainty that the Lazarus plant was used to trigger the attacks on both planets. Uh, there's no way a plant this rare, this fragile, just shows up here New Atlantis and Tau Ceti. The transformations on those worlds, they must have been triggered by human hands. Captain, do you understand what it is we just stumbled on here? Exactly. Someone saw the Lazarus plant in action and used it to trigger the attacks. I wonder where they could have gotten such an idea. Deploying alien life forms as weapons. I wouldn't be shocked to find out our team in part inspired the approach, but our group never dealt with something that could have an effect like this. Makes some sense, actually. Tau Ceti was likely their first test, someplace remote where no one would question a few settlers going missing. Ensure the big show, the attack on New Atlantis would be a success. And the timing of that one it couldn't have been just luck that it happened right when we were asking the cabinet to do something about the Terramorphs. These attacks. I think someone planned them to set all this in motion. I can't. At least, I didn't think it could. But maybe if we're right about this, someone bound away. They certainly were. Who could pull something like this off? And why? Let's save the discussion for when you all aren't standing in the universe's closest equivalent to hell frozen over. If we're gonna do anything to prevent more Terramorph attacks, human cause or otherwise, we need that final sample. Roger that. Kaiser, get us into the spaceport. The entrance is this way. Ideas where we could get some extra juice? Local power looks like it was controlled in the security office. Upper floor. Captain and I can scout it out. Kaiser, see if you can't find another way to get it open. Roger that. I have restored power to the office entrance. You may proceed. panel. Still looks operable. Of all the things to survive.
Captive, I think I see it. Reboot engaged. Running diagnostic. Diagnostic complete. Multiple systems unavailable. Warning, priority safety concern detected. Exterior hatch power restored. Back in business. Warning, emergency recorder message detected. That's... that's my father he's addressing. He... was here? Didn't think he'd have the guts to look those soldiers in the eye before blowing this place to pieces. Admiral! It just... transformed. An invisible weapon. No planet would be safe. Colonel, the troops that closed off the sewers after my evaluation, they're all in this facility. Other than our casualties, yes, sir. Good. Get them into defensive positions around the spaceport. No one leaves. I'll send ships as soon as possible. Thank God. None of us wanted to go down swarmed by those things. That won't be your fate, Colonel. You have my word. Transcription complete. Physical copy available. An invisible weapon. He knew. He knew about the Lazarus plan. Grab that recording. We... We should talk. I also wish to be prepared for any situation, but there are practical limits, you know? Hey, Victus. He destroyed this place. Killed these people to keep what he knew about the Lazarus plan and the terror morphs and all this a secret, didn't he? He saw the potential of the plant as a weapon and hid it away. He killed those people, condemned this city to keep them from sharing what they might have seen. He was a. was. Yes. Exactly what we all thought he was. But I guess... I guess that's just another part of his sick legacy now. He thought he was protecting us all, taking the secret to his grave. Only he didn't succeed. Now someone else knows about the Lazarus plant and is using it exactly how he feared. Right. Kaiser, try it now. Guys, your sample, it moved. I'd be real careful out there if I were you. That sound good. Eyes peeled.
Guess we should grab that sample while we can. Good. Then just stash that sample with Kaiser and we're done. Final sample secure. All wrapped up. Time to get the hell out of here. Percival, you should unplug and find somewhere we can talk. Privately. On it. See you soon. frantic on the comms towards the end there, but it sounded like this was a success. Got everything we need to put this plan in motion. Ah, best place for him. Now, my connection might have gotten a bit fuzzy there, but do I have it right that Vey Victus knew about this damn plan? That's what it sounded like. <laughs> Guess the old Admiral must have told someone what he learned. Even he's not clever enough to pull off an attack like that from the great beyond. <laughs> no ghost is that clever. But it's clear someone knows about the plant and realized what ends it could be put towards. Captain, we need to get these samples back to the lab and verify we'll be able to handle cleaning up the leeches as well as the terramorphs. But in the interim, do you think you could look into what we uncovered? 
See if you can turn up any information on who might have committed the attacks. If it were me, I'd start at the scene of the crime. New Atlantis. Thank you, Captain. Once you've finished your investigation, we'll meet you outside the cabinet chambers. They're gonna want to hear this. Take care of yourself. No telling who might be involved. <laughs>